hi everyone welcome back to my channel in this video i'm sharing my daily to do list for upcoming examination so i applied rrb pivo i'm not applied for clerk so that's why in this video i'm sharing my daily to do list for upcoming rrb pivo preliminary examination we have only 15 days time for this preliminary examination so in these 15 days what i'm practicing and what i'm following for rrb pivo prelims examination so all these things we will discuss in this video so in every day I am following these three things must and should for this RRB paper preliminary examination. At present, the first one that is daily reading current FIs. So maximum number of students asking about current FI source. So I suggested only few source that is either order or FIs cloud. So which is your choice. You will follow either of these only. So because nowadays current FIs scoring more marks in current FIs is a big task. So that's why you will focus on only two to three hours per day on this current FIs because we will meet expected sectional cutoff for this RRB paper preliminary mains examination in each PIVO and clerk examination so that's why you will maintain two to three hours for this current FI section in each and every day so this is very important so I suggested ADDA so I suggested ADDA or AC so these two are the best sources for current FIs as per my view I followed FIs cloud so some others followed ADDA also and next second thing that is daily attempt one free live mock test available in respective platforms like guidely textbook Oli board practice mock and s mock preparation app so there are many platforms for this free live mock test so each and every platform in every week they will provide one live mock test for RRB PIVO and another live mock test for RRB clerk so in Oli board SBA PIVO prelims live mock test also available so please utilize and attempt these free live mock tests so these are very helpful for each and everyone not only for beginners already preparing students so we will easy to score more marks and we will easy to increase our speed in real examination also so that's why you will try to attempt one free live mock test per day or else if there is no live on respect to platforms you will go with one paid mock test for your purchase test series so i purchased textbook so that's why daily i attempt one free live mock test so otherwise one paid mock test in textbook so this is my second thing in my to-do list and third one that is this is also very important analysis of attempted mock test so which mock test that is either free live mock test or paid mock test so after the completion of this mock test you will carefully analyze each and every question and each and every mistake in your attempted test series so it is very important because we have to know which and which are your weak areas and which are your strong areas so this is very important to analyze this mock test okay so in second thing that is daily attempt one free mock test so some of the candidates are also asking about which platforms it means which sources better for upcoming examination especially for banking I suggested so already in last in previous videos I'm already telling you guys so at present I suggested practice mock or OB or textbook or guide link okay so many of them asking about either PM or OB or TB so only at present I purchased only textbook after the IBPS PIVO notification, I will try to buy practice mock also. So for this RRB PIVO preliminary examination, I followed only textbook. And also in PM, OB textbook guide, free live mock test also I am attempting. And third is analysis of attempted mock test. Maximum candidates are worried about their score. Their scores in respective platforms like free live mock test or suggested test series. It means purchase test series. So don't worry about that. You will maintain 50 to 55. Okay. In every mock, you will maintain 50 to 55 marks for RRB PIVO. So this is the safe score in real examination also. If paper either moderate or difficult, so whatever it may be, I will try to attempt. And also you will try to maintain 50 to 55 is a safe score for RRB PIVO to clear this preliminary examination. And some of them apply for RRB clerk that is OA okay so safe score for this RRB OA is any category 70 plus is the 
save score for this RRB office assistant. So you will maintain PO 50 to 55 score and also in office assistant 70 plus score. So these are the safe score for RRB P1 clerk examination. Each and every one you will try to attempt more mocks in these last 15 days because to increase your speed along with your score is very important. If your speed is increases automatically your score also increases. So that's why in last 15 days in these 15 days you will try to attempt two mocks per day. Those who are applied for both P1 and the clerk. So otherwise if you have no time daily attempt one mock test. So this is much and sure. So this is my prelims to do list video and after the preliminary examination I will upload my main to do list video. So thank you guys. If you have any doubts about our preparation so please mention and ask your doubts in my comment section. So once again all the very best for each and everyone.